What's up you guys, Shardimus Prime here, doing a rant review on the Transformers R.E.D. series, Optimus Prime, Megatron, and Soundwave. Trying to get your Transformers? You can do so. Big, big, big. Get your big badass toys at BigBadToyStore.com. Click the link in the description below. And while you're down there, please go ahead and hit that like button and hit the subscribe button as well as the notification bell. And I need to give an extra disclaimer for this video. There may be some cursing that's not uh, really appropriate for all age viewers. Also, um, I'm going to get pissed off in this video, but I want you guys to know that I'm not really upset over any action figures right here. Life is good. There's too many things to be happy for, okay? But I'm going to get real pissed off for this video anyway. So if you're a softie, when it comes to opinions that don't correlate with yours, you may want to dip out of here. But if you want to have some fun and stick around and Listen to me tear into this line, then, you know, stick around. First off, I gotta say, not into transforming figure or Transformers figures that don't transform. However, I do think two toy companies get a pass. Uh, one of them is 3-0 and the other one is Hot Toys. And I've always said this, those are the two companies that I give a pass as far as non-transforming figures. And it's because they look amazing. I mean, look at this 3-0 Prime right here. This is spectacular. And they actually do have a sound wave that does have a transforming Ravage. So technically, 3-0 does have transforming Transformers. You can see his blaster rifle is kind of slipping out right over there. Um, and these figures uh, right here, the R.E.D. figures, well, th these are not them. These are just little vinyl toys that uh, I picked up, I think, in 2013. And yeah, my, my daughters play with these things. So these are not even the R.E.D. figures. And I got to mention again, like, I don't pick up figures I don't like or I don't think are cool. That's why most of my videos are more positive videos i don't really spend a lot of money on things i just don't like but um i did see unparalleled universe's video on this and he's the biggest red fan so uh yeah shout out to him and his love for non-transforming transformers because he's fucking lazy so he just wants to you know pose him around and not transform him yeah based off of uh wade's review this is like the height difference so that's how small the red figures are actually maybe even smaller than this so uh, yeah, they're fairly small figures and they don't look good to me like they don't look like they're well detailed or anything to make up for it on the prime I know there's like translucent plastic and you can see the matrix of leadership in there But it's just it's like super obviously just like sticking out there and there's no detail in it The figures don't have any kind of crazy detail in them at all whatsoever And by the way, if you got fooled by the thumbnail of this video that just goes to show how lame the R.E.D. figures are. And I feel bad for anybody that worked on them that, you know, put a lot of effort. I'm sure they're well articulated and they do their thing. But to me, the non-transforming transformer aspect of it just really bums me out. And I've heard people leave some stupid ass messages saying things like calling people that want transforming transformers dumbasses, like, because we don't know what it's supposed to transform into. Like you leave it in robot mode and then like you act like you don't know what the other mode is supposed to be because you have it in robot mode. Is that why you're so mad? I, I don't get it why you would hate uh, Transformers fans that want transforming Transformers because that is part of the freaking toy, all right? It's supposed to be a robot, it's supposed to be a puzzle, and then it's supposed to be an alt mode toy. That's those three things, right? You get you get robot, you get puzzle, you get truck. You get robot, you get puzzle, you get gun. You get robot, you get puzzle, you get Walkman. That's the that's the the toy right there, and it's done and it's doable. I love the engineering from Takara Tomy's Transformers Masterpiece MP44 Optimus Prime. This thing is amazing. It has all the articulation that I want to see if I show it off properly, but it has all the accessories. I mean, the price point is fucking ridiculous. I get it, okay? It, it's it, it's out of, like, we're talking like 400 bucks over here when the RED figures are 20 bucks. Like, that shouldn't really be a part of it. But the point is, is that the engineering here is amazing, that you have all this articulation. It looks so freaking clean. The backpack doesn't bother me, but it does bother some people, you know? I, I'm aware of that. But this thing is just such an incredible piece of art to me that they're able to get this guy to transform as well as he does and look as amazing as he does. It's just an incredible work of art so to take something like this and then just kind of knock out the whole transforming aspect of it is kind of like well, what the fuck is that that's like, like what are you doing like, like what are you making you know what i mean like you're just i guess it's a transformers marvel legend figure and i get it 
again, I do like some non-transforming transformers, but they look amazing. Like the paint apps are outstanding and everything on these three zero figures that are out of this world. So they make up for it in that regard. With the RED figures, it's just not making up for it for me at all. I just don't like the way they look. They look too much like these fucking things right here, man. I mean, for real, you got fooled by the thumbnail, didn't you? Didn't you? So, yeah, man, just, I don't know. I think they're lame. Uh, I won't be picking any of them up. If I end up reviewing them, um, it'll probably be because someone sent them to me, which I don't necessarily need anybody to do. I have no desire uh, to get my hands on those figures. They, it, I have no place for them in the collection or anything like that. And uh, and I think it's catering to um, to people that are kind of just a little lazy about transforming. That, that, that's all what it is, you know? Just lazy, man. You don't want to transform him. Now, I understand it takes time and everything. I actually kind of like set aside time to transform my figures, especially with my masterpiece figures over there, because it takes so long. So uh, I kind of get it. I get it. And, you know, if you like the characters, you just want to pose them around. And like I said earlier, man, I'm not really hating on anybody or anybody liking something that I don't like. You know, how could I? That's that's ridiculous. You know, I get how you just want to pose them around, look at the character and, and do your thing. And you have no desire at all to actually transform transform anything which is fucking lame but still you know uh to each their own like i said i'm not seriously hating but just for me personally i think the red line is bullshit take it out guys and burn it and i don't recommend picking those up because they don't transform and i am sudding out here because i have never even held the figure yet so take my opinion with a grain of salt yeah I'm fully studded out over here. Look, dude, I'm, I'm studding out so hard that I actually spit on my review station. Look at that. I am a stuck-up dork. I totally get it. <laughs> I actually went full sud, all right? Russ went full sud over here, and I actually spit it. Look, there's the coffee stain, right? There's the spit stain, or the sud stain, I guess we could call it from here on out. But um, just so you can get an idea, uh, here's a handless uh, Marvel Legends Big Time Badass Spider-Man. So there you go for a size comparison with which is probably the height of the RED figures, which again, easy pass. So anyway, <laughs> I want to know what you guys think. I mean, do you like transforming figures? I like sitting there and and getting my whole instruction booklet out and and putting on some tunes and, and transforming or, or listening to a podcast and transforming my figure. To me, it's a lot of fun. I'm a big nerd about it. I've been transforming figures since I was at least five years old. So uh, to me, that's like where a lot of the passion is for just actually transforming things. And now I want to transform my MP44 Optimus Prime. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this stupid video and <laughs> hope you all had a good day. I hope you all understand that this is just all in good fun. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys <laughs> hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and I will catch you guys later. Peace. Hey, let me show you Prime videos. Hey, you should click one. Yeah, click on one of them. Or subscribe if you haven't.